Hi everyone, it's my honor to introduce my our new product, Isalog. Isalog is a brand new concept about how you interact or communicate with your hair designer. First, why do we need Isalog? A lot of people just like you and me may have this experience. When you want to get a haircut, you go inside the shop and you sit down on the sofa, the designer comes and you too may have a, have a happy discussion on your hair. After that, the process starts and you, you would absolutely have no idea what the design, designer would bring about. But something seems to, to be unreal, less a verbal discussion with no any other assisting tool. Sounds terrible, huh? So with eyes alone, you, uh, you can use this device to discuss your hairstyle with your designer on a panel vividly, which supports which uh, on a panel which supports sub, uh, several salon functions such as hair cutting, wig wearing, and dyeing. Next, we'll introduce the technology part. The eyes the eye salon system is built on the recognition on the three elements. The first one is face, and the second one is hair, and the last one is background. We need to get out these three elements from the picture of the user. Okay, first, what, how do we do face recognition? First, uh, we, we will at first do uh, detect skin pixels through YCBC or color space, and then we'll go through raw measure skin for massive skin subarrays. For example, skin pixels are uh, plus two and minus one for pixels that are not skin. And at last, we will do color scan for, to find out the maximum skin area as a user base. Next, our job is looking for the hair. Looking for hair, we first transform the RGB into HSL color space. After that, we give some constraint on judging which one is hair pixel and which is not. For example, smaller lightness value represents darkness, and a smaller saturation value means it is close to gray color. And the background recognition is, is just use, using the HSL color space, uh, just like the hair detection. But a different way is that we pick up pixels with different, different values, uh, uh, which is more likely to be light blue color. So we, we want to use the three elements we just found to realize the several sub functions such as uh, haircut, wear, wig, wig wearing, and dyeing. So for haircut, we will reveal the face region with oval shape first, and, the, and the, always detect the user's touch, uh, uh, always detect the user's fingers while on the screen, and the store the cut information pixel by pixel in the memory. Whenever the hair was cut, is cut away, it won't show up again on the screen until the user leaves the hair cut function. As, as for hair width wearing, we already have the position information of the face and the hair, so we will put on the chosen width at the right place according to the two important elements. And last, how do we implement hair dyeing? First, users can click on the button to choose a piece or her favorite color, and the system will automatically flood, flood this color onto the, all the hair pixels. So the above is all about our design content. With the help of Isalon, there would be less communication barrier between people and the, and the hair designer. In the future, 
people can enjoy their own hairstyle experience and no longer worry about their hairstyle will be much different from what they hold in their mind. Thank you for listening.